5 to the x plus 5 to the 3x equal to 30. Please don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell. So here we want to use changing variable. So I define what I call this one a. It means what? 5 to the x equal to a. So 5 to the 3x equal to what? So it is 5 to the x plus 5 to the 3x. You can say 5 to the x to the power of what? The power of 3 equal to 30. So the first part is what? a plus a cubed equal to 30. If we take all things to left hand side, at first I write a cubed, then plus a, 30 to left hand side, negative 30 equal to 0. Now, here, when you have quad, uh, a polynomial, the degree is greater than 2. For degree 2, we know we can use quadratic formula. But here, one of the most useful way and typical way is to find one root. So if we check a2, 2 cubed plus 2, 10 doesn't work. a3 is a root of this because 3 cubed plus 3 minus 30 equal to 3 cubed 27 plus 3 minus 30. It is 30 minus 30, 0. So then, because 3 is a root, you can write this, a cubed plus a minus 30 equal to what? We can factor from a minus 3, and it will be what? a squared times a a cubed minus 3 a squared. So you should cancel minus 3. So here, until here, we have a cubed minus 3 a squared. So I should, because here we don't have a square, I should cancel this. So I place 3a, then 3a times this plus 3a squared, minus 3 times this minus 9a. So we want to reach a, but here it is negative 9a. So if I add plus 10, then plus 10a, here it will be a, and it is okay, and here it will be canceled. 10 minus 3, negative 30. So it is, this is one of the most useful ways. You check the numbers. For example, a3 works, 0. So a minus 3 is one factor. Then like this, you can find next factor. So it is this. So it is 0. So we know this part is 0. Here, we conclude the first term is 0. a minus 3 is 0. Or the next part, a squared plus 3a plus 10 equal to zero for this one you take negative three to right hand side a equal three for this one for the next part it is a quadratic formula in terms of a here the formula is this it is we call it discriminant inside the square root it should be at least zero if we calculate discriminant here it will be what b squared b here is three three squared minus four a is one the coefficient of this C. It is 9 minus 40 is negative 31 less than 0. If discriminant less than 0, we don't have any answer here. So we should only consider when a equal to 3. a is 3. We said a is 5 to the x. So 5 to the x equal to 3. So here we can take a log from both sides in the same base. For example, log you can consider ln base e or base 10. It's not important. Log 5x equal log 3. So by this rule, you can say logarithm rules. You can take x in front of log, x log 5 equal to log 3. And by this, if we divide both sides by log 5, it will be log 3 over log 5. So the answer is log 3 over log 5. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on the bell.